In this video, I'm going to give you a repeatable system for turning ideas into engaging YouTube video scripts extremely fast using AI, while making sure your content stays 100% original, true to your brand, doesn't plagiarize other people's work, or sound like a robot. I will have all the prompts that we'll be using in this video as templates in the description below so you can pick them up and follow along with this tutorial. With that being said, let me show you how to write engaging YouTube video scripts extremely fast using AI. So it took me a while to start incorporating AI in my script writing process because I always thought that it can can produce nothing more than just generic outputs with zero new ones. Turns out that I was just going at it completely the wrong way and it's much more efficient than I originally thought. Because instead of trying to get the AI to write like me and put everything I know into a cohesive script, I just had to give it a clear understanding of the subject that I will be breaking down and how other popular videos on the same subject structure the information for a better viewing experience and more conversions. Leaving me and my clients with enough guidance to actually deliver the script but also enough flexibility to showcase our own expertise. Now let me show you a bird's eye view of how this system is going to function before we jump in depth into each section on its own. First we need to find three to five tall pranking YouTube videos about the same subject, idea or keyword. Then we're going to analyze these videos inside ChatGPT and create a whole new outline based on the informational flow of these videos. Next we're going to edit our outline, go through it, add any key points or crucial information that we need to add in. Then we're going to add a hook, call to actions and social proof to make it convert even better. And lastly we're going to finalize our script ready for the recording process. But before we jump in, I should let you know that you will need a premium ChatGPT subscription because we will be using the plugins, specifically the link access plugin to actually analyze the YouTube videos. So make sure you have a plus account before trying to follow this tutorial. So step one, we need to find top ranking videos about the same idea, keyword or topic on YouTube. Simply search your idea and see what comes up. For this example, let's say Shopify SEO. And here we will see all the results. One crucial thing to keep in mind is the release date of the video because we're looking for fresh, relevant content and not ideas that might be outdated or not apply anymore. So with that in mind, let's take a look what's going on over here on the results. To make this even easier, we can go to filters, upload date and this year. And we're only going to see videos that were uploaded this year. So Shopify SEO optimization guide, SEO for your Shopify store, Shopify SEO optimization for beginners. These are all good videos that we can actually use and analyze to create a brand new outline using ChatGPT. So next you need to go to ChatGPT and enable the access link plugin which essentially lets you analyze and get information from YouTube videos really, really easily and fast. So this is the prompt that I will be using to extract the information I need and actually create a new outline. You can copy and paste it from the description into ChatGPT and actually get going really, really fast. So the prompt is, Analyze the top ranking YouTube videos about the keyword Shopify SEO for context, information, and structure. Then combine their outlines to create a new YouTube video outline that combines all the winning elements into one comprehensive tutorial. And then I just paste my links down here, videos, and here are my links. So let's just send it over and see what happens. As you can see, access link is getting to work, analyzing the videos. Let's just wait a couple of seconds until it's done. And here it is. It analyzed all the videos and it's coming up with a new outline that we can use to script our videos really, really fast. How cool is this? And the best part about this method is that you don't copy anyone or plagiarize other people's work. You just use the informational flow that will retain viewers from start to finish and actually put your own spin and expertise in it. So let's take a look at the result, right? It's a pretty long outline, pretty well structured. So it has bullet points for each section and titles for each section to guide you through the delivery of the script. So let's take a look at the title, Ultimate Shopify SEO Masterclass, Boost Your Source Traffic and Sales in 2024. We have an introduction with bullet points, briefly introduce the topic of Shopify SEO and its importance for e-commerce success. Section one, understanding Shopify SEO, discuss why SEO is a cost-effective strategy compared to paid ads, yada, yada, yada. This is a really, really good outline guiding you through the, every section that you need to cover to clearly convey your idea and deliver your information to your audience. So if you're not satisfied with the result immediately, you can just give it a couple of new prompts, tweak it a little bit to get the result you want. But for the sake of this video, I'm just going to use it as it is to go straight to the next step. So as you can see, I just pasted the outline into Google Docs and it came up like this. If you have the same problem, all you have to do is just hit Control A to select everything, go to the text color, make it black, then go to format, paragraphs and styles, borders and shading, and go to background color and put none. It might show white, but it's not really white. It just doesn't read it properly. So put none, then apply, 
and boom, you're ready to go. So now let me show you the ultimate cheat code you can use to actually make it more in-depth and enrich your script without putting too much work. So let's take this bullet point right here, which is discuss the importance of a mobile-friendly responsive design. We can just copy this, go to ChatGPT, and then we can use this prompt. Explain the importance of a mobile-friendly responsive design in a couple of short paragraphs. So essentially the template for this prompt is explain blank in a couple of short paragraphs. This is important for later, you will figure out why. And boom, ChatGPT is explaining the importance of a mobile friendly and responsive design in a couple of short paragraphs. But as you can see, this is really formal. It uses really in-depth language and it's really hard to understand and actually convey the idea. So what we will do is actually use another prompt to simplify it and make it way more conversational. And that simple prompt is just simplify it like you're explaining it to someone. And this is exactly how you will explain it in your videos. So it makes sense. And sure enough, here it is. Let's compare the two to see why this actually works and why it's so efficient. The first one, the importance of a mobile friendly responsive design in today's digital landscape cannot be overstated. Who talks like that? As you can see, this is really formal, really in-depth, hard to understand. This is not going to work for a YouTube video. But let's take a look at the simplified version. Think of a mobile, friendly, responsive design like having a magic outfit that can instantly resize to fit you perfectly, whether you're a kid or a grown-up. See how conversational this is and how you can easily break down complex ideas into simple, short paragraphs that people can easily digest and understand and follow along with? Crazy. And you can just go through your whole script and do that for every single bullet point or just the bullet points that you need some extra help with or maybe some conversation starters. It all depends on what you actually need. If you need a word for word script, this is going to work perfectly for you. Now, if you just need some help with a couple of paragraphs to get the conversation started, you can just do it for a couple of paragraphs throughout your script and you're good to go. So after you're done editing your outline and adding any crucial information that you needed, it's time to add a hook, social proof and call to actions. First, you will need a simple yet effective hook. Then you will need social proof to build credibility and back the claim you just made with your hook. And lastly, you will need a benefit-driven call to action to drive traffic towards a lead magnet or maybe your sales page or whatever you want to drive your traffic towards. So let's start off with how to write engaging hooks for your YouTube videos. Now, if you're talking to a B2B audience, you will want to keep things simple and straight to the point. Pretty much the only thing you have to do with your hook is just validate the click and satisfy the viewer. Make them go like, hmm, this looks like it's for me, which you can easily do by hinting at a pain point or a problem that they might be facing or a desired outcome or goal that they're chasing after. To do that, you can just use these two prompts to find negative and positive ideas for your hooks. Let's start with the negative hook. Give me 10 painful problems a business might face if they don't resolve issue, which we can go and turn into give me 10 painful problems an e-commerce business might face if they don't have good SEO. So as you can see, ChatGPT came up with 10 painful problems that you can use in your hook to make it way more engaging and capture attention easily, like low website visibility, decreased organic traffic. You can go through all these key points and find out which one works best for your specific circumstance and actually go with it. Now, if you want a positive hook instead of something negative like a pain point or a problem, you can use this prompt. Give me 10 positive outcomes outcomes a business might achieve if resolve issue. Again, give me 10 positive outcomes an e-commerce business might achieve if they have good SEO. And sure enough, ChatGPT came up with 10 really good benefits that you can use to build a positive hook. So this is an example hook I just came up with so you can get the idea and actually get the ball rolling. In this video, I'll show you how to 3x your Shopify store's traffic in the next 30 days 100% organically without spending a penny on ads. Someone who is looking for Shopify SEO will be hooked immediately. You're talking about 3x your Shopify store's traffic. You give a timeline for 30 days. You point out that it's 100% organically and without spending a penny on ads. If that's your target audience, this will really resonate with those people because these are the problems they face on the daily and this is actually their desired outcomes and goals. So after you've hooked your audience in the beginning of the video, you need to back the claim you just made using social proof to really get your point across. That can either be case studies, client interviews, testimonials, screenshots, whatever that is for your specific scenario and whatever is more relevant to your target audience. So for example, this is the exact system we used to help our client Mike go from 10,000 per month to 35,000 thousand per month in just 35 days. Simple, straight to the point, and you can plug your case studies, testimonial, client interviews, screenshots, whatever goes best with that specific statement. And lastly, you need to implement a benefit-driven call to action to drive traffic towards a lead magnet or your sales page or your DMs or whatever that is. This is simple. And as the word says, it needs to be benefit 
get driven. It needs to be driven by the benefits. You need to clearly state what your audience can expect by actually taking action. For example, for this video, a good call to action could be like, so if you want to scale your e-commerce store to over $50,000 per month in the next 90 days without adding any unnecessary operational complexity to your business, click the link below and let's see how we can help you achieve just that. Simple, straight to the point, benefit-driven, clearly conveys the value of your offer and sets clear expectations. So this was the last crucial component that we need to finalize this script. Now, all you have to do is just go through your script, read it through, make sure everything is on point, everything is ready to be recorded, and you can even take your script into ChatGPT and ask it for feedback. And nine times out of 10, in my experience, the feedback that I receive from ChatGPT actually helps me identify the potential places that I'm lacking in which is really, really helpful in improving your script. It's like having somebody else to give you feedback live that actually has knowledge over what you're talking about and actually has knowledge over content marketing and YouTube overall. Now, if you're an agency or B2B coach, we will fully automate all your YouTube content operations and generate 10 to 15 qualified sales appointments every single month in the next 90 days using a 100% done for you content funnel or you don't pay. All you will ever have to do is just get on a call with me for two to three hours per month, record the content and send it over. We take care of literally everything else. This is the exact system we use to generate over $6,000 in directly attributable revenue for our client Will in the first ever month of actually getting to work together and the first four videos we uploaded. So if that sounds interesting, click the link in the description and book a call with me so we can get in touch, see if we're fit and help you make more money. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you got tons of value out of it. And if you did, make sure to like and subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.